day in America, hundreds of thousands of students participate in extracurricular activities. All right, the first person I'm going to interview for this uh, documentary will be Deasia. She's a part of the uh, Lincoln High School marching band. And she plays the clarinet. Uh, that's one of the many instruments that you can choose to play if you want to join the uh, band. Uh, different schools have a different variety of instruments, so you can choose whatever you want. You can be in the marching band, uh, any type of band you want to be in, and this is a, it's a pretty good way to uh, to join the extracurricular activities because anybody can play an instrument. Alright, so how does the school help you play the clarinet? When I first got in band, I didn't know how to play no instruments, so they, well, the band director taught me how to play the clarinet, and I get to pull him. So, how does playing the clarinet help you in school? Um, it helps me because in a band, if you have failing grades, then you can't perform. So, being in a band, basically helps me keep my grades up. Alright, so next is Mariah. Uh, she's a cheerleader. Uh, you can either cheerlead on the JV or varsity uh, school, cheerleading squad. She's on the varsity squad. They cheer most of the uh, football, basketball, and any of the sports games we have at school. How does cheerleading help you in school? Uh, it helps me keep my grades up and work harder to try to get scholarships and everything. So if you wasn't cheerleading, would you be the same student that you are right now? Honestly, no, because I think I just wouldn't be. Because our coach pushes us to like keep our grades up and just work harder. Okay. All right, so the third person that I interviewed for the documentary is Bird. Uh, he's a, he plays on the JV uh, football squad. So you could like just like cheerleading, you could play JV or varsity. Uh, this is the varsity team showing at the homecoming game this year. So uh, this is one of the easiest ways you can join an activity after school because uh, every well, most people who uh, go to Lincoln play football or basketball or something. So this is a, one of the best ways to join something if you want to. So, uh, how does how does your football help you, like with your schoolwork? So, it helped me because I try to keep my grades up so I can play football, so I do better in school. All right. So, uh, how does the school help you uh, play f with playing football? So, they buy us uniform, they feed us at school, and they take us to the game, get us a bus, make sure our bus is on time, and make sure we ready. All right, so do you think you'll be the uh, same student if you if it wasn't for football? No, because I wouldn't do right in school. I think I'd be doing bad things. Like I think I'd be wrong. Like football keep me out of trouble and stuff, make me do good in school. All right. All right. So lastly, we have David. Uh, he's a, he's a filmmaker and producer. He likes to make films and uh, he does it at school and at home. Cut. Yeah. All right, so how does filmmaking help you academically? All right, so um, I would say that filmmaking has helped me academically because there's a lot of writing in it. Like, you got to, like, write the script and the production schedule and the shot sheet. And if you're not in filmmaking, you probably don't know what that is. But regardless, um, you have to do a lot of writing. And so I would say it's really helped me, like, improve my writing skills and, like, help me, like, you know, write better, obviously. And, yeah. All right, so how does the school help you? Uh, make films? Um, the school helped me make films by like obviously they teach me how to like they show me how to use the camera and how to edit on the computer things like that and they also teach me like how I have to make the film like I have to start like writing the script and all the paperwork first and then you know then we start filming and then we present so that's how um, the school has helped me like make films.